how do you feel about people like you know starting to uh to tell on these people like look man little ray ray was trying to get initiated in the gang and he accidentally shot the kid like how do, well, how do you well, feel about <clears throat> i'm not sure like until we start doing our own really policing you see what i'm saying like I'm not sure how I feel about that right there. Like I just saw a video today where police had a young man down on the ground. Big police was on his back with his knee. Now there's a bunch of brothers around yeah. trying to make sure that they don't, that um, homie don't put his knee on his neck or nothing, right? Right. But now these dudes like go above and beyond the call of duty in my eye. You know, a lot of people were saying, oh, this is how it should be done. This is, you know, this is how policing should be done. But hold up. Like, we're not doing their job for them. Like, like they went over there and, like, he was like, well, help me. I need help. They was like, you need help? He's like, yeah, I need help. Because the homie wouldn't, like, bring his arm around. He wouldn't fully cooperate. So they're getting down all in the front of him. Just cooperate with him. Put your arms out. Hang on. I'm going to grab his arm for you. Now that these dudes went out and grabbed homie's arm and put it behind his back so that the police could handcuff him. Keep in mind, as they walked up, the young man says he's lying. Right. He said the police was lying. So how do we know we out here trying to, da, 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 you know, we're going to help the police. How do we know that we're not helping them do some bullshit with some of this shit? Yeah. Motherfuckers got to slow down with their fucking emotions sometimes and really assess what the fuck is going on. Like, 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 you so quick to help the police, though, but I don't see people quick to help the victim, like, to get the police off of these motherfuckers. Like, it, I, that's what I'm not really seeing. Well, the, also, I wanted to say real yeah. quick before I before the thought lo loses me. Let's not let's not get it twisted and act like the police is the problem. The police are just the muscle for the motherfuckers in power. So right now they're trying to use the police as a scapegoat. As if, if we just get rid of the police or, or somehow rearrange just the police, everything will be okay. But we have to understand that systemic racism doesn't just mean in the police force. It means within the fabric of America itself. And these dogs are being sipped on us by someone. They're not just autonomous dogs. So... Let's not just focus all our anger on the police and understand the ones who's using the police as their arm of muscle. Yep. Yep. Godfrey. Man, um, it's real. Um like I saw that video, man. God damn. And at first they were like, yo, let him go, get your hand right. off his neck. Da, da, da. I was like, all right, bet. Then he'd say, yo, don't, don't, and then dude said he's lying. But what was he saying he's lying about? That's what I was confused about. Whatever the crime like, could have been. He's going, he's lying. So he what, if, lying what is that mean? Oh, if, if, if I, so, okay, if I, if, if you're there, if you're there going, he's lying, I don't think they should have helped him like that. They, they, they should have said, yo, what is he saying? He's saying you guys are lying. Lying about what? What are y'all lying about? Because I didn't understand. He's lying. Lying about what? And of course the cops will be like, hey, you want to help us out? Get your own brother in jail? Sure. Dumbasses. What the fuck so were they doing? Eager to help. It was, to me, it was coonish. That was coonish as fuck. That was coonish as fuck. My thing is people like... People were like, now that's how it should be done. That's, right. that's what we need. Yeah, it's to like black on... That's like black on black, whatever, again. But do y'all... Do, so, do, do y'all don't know what he was getting arrested for? I mean, no. maybe... No. Maybe the hood had already figured something out, and this was like, okay, like you need to be held accountable. May I mean, maybe why? Why I, would they? I don't know. I don't know. I just feel like you know. Again, you know, we act so gangster with our own people and all this stuff. Yep. You see what I'm saying? 
But when it comes, or maybe, to they acting, just, or maybe they didn't want him to get killed or something. Like maybe that's they how thought, they was acting. Trust me, that's how they was acting in the name of safety. But see, there's uh, okay. a lot of there's a lot of bullshit that goes in the name of safety. There's a lot of civil liberties that get given away. A lot of freedoms get given away in the name of safety. And so we gotta stop all of this acting like, oh, we're just being safe. We were just trying to make sure the brother get, didn't get killed. I get that. I understand that and I commend y'all for that. But to go above and beyond the call of duty and start, you know, going over and reaching into a, into a, a scene where the police was, 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 was trying to lock this motherfucker up and now you're grabbing his arm and putting it behind his back. That's just a little too much for me right there. Like, like you just mm -hmm. needed to be a conscientious but, observer in that moment. But I don't think you can, you can like go over there and push the police off and you, you get shot, you know? Well, that's why people, listen, that's why that's, people hold back because they're going to get shot. You got to take. If you see these niggas killing a motherfucker, I did actually. I did see. A, I did see a video. I think it was in D.C. where like the cops had started like piling on one guy, and next thing you know, you just saw people coming from out their houses like rushing the cops. It was like an old man even wrestling with one cop. Yeah. I mean, when it was when it was all said and done, they had everybody you know on the ground getting arrested. But what it did, what they did do was they stopped. The police from, from killing right. somebody in, 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 right in front of their eyes. They stopped right. them from killing somebody in front of their eyes. And if they had to go to jail or got beat up a little bit, oh well, shit happens. Like, but you you see what I'm saying? Like, freedom is yeah. not free. Like, motherfuckers want shit to be so like just easy without no bumps and bruises. Like, like when you're birthing something, there's labor pains. You know what I mean? Like any woman can attest to that. In order to have the beauty of life, you know, you got to go through extreme pain. And there's no getting around it, even though a lot of women do try to get around it and get knocked out and let it get cut out of them and all that other shit. But whatever, that's a whole other story. But it's traditionally... That, it's their right to do that. <laughs> Y'all ain't got babies. Listen, that's some, that's some that's European true. bullshit. And really, it shouldn't be your right to do that because it's a, a certain oh, unnecessary. But anyway, Whoa. that's all.